So why don't you touch upon the other products real quick, uh, and then we'll start wrapping up if you don't mind. So sure, of course. Time. Yeah. Okay. All right. So we we all we all know the the absolute most important thing is the flagship, the Stem Enhance Ultra. That's uh, that's the absolute for for everybody. I, I believe basically everybody, uh, pretty much everybody in the world, uh, should should consider that that product there. Um, we've spoken about that at length and, and what adult stem cells can do for you, et cetera, already. Great. Sometimes people can have some issues in their body that need additional support, Ian, I guess is the best way to put it. One of the most common issues that we, we do come across is that while ever we're releasing adult stem cells, those adult stem cells need to be able to access the tissues so that they can do that lock on thing. And the point at where that lock on happens is in the very, very thinnest, very most tiny of your blood vessels, your microvasculature that are only sort of a few, um, a few blood cells across or even a single blood cell and single file across. These things are tiny and you need, you need the room for the adult stem cells to go through those very, those very small blood vessels. Unfortunately, when you are inflamed or if you have a, a, some kind of invading pathogenic organism in your body of some kind or, or if you become injured or any of these kind of things, that tells your body to set off a process of inflammation. And one of the side effects of that inflammation is that there is a, plas there is a plasma born protein which is called fibrin, basically. And um, it, will, it will drop out of the plasma and become a sticky, glue-like, spider-webby blockage in the, in the fine vessels, which will still allow the blood fluid to flow through there, but it blocks everything else off because what, what we're trying to achieve here is we're trying to stop this invading pathogen from getting access to all the other tissues in the body. We're trying to lock it down so that we can nuke it where it is sort of thing. So your body will drop fibrin into your small veins. That's great. It, it's, your body's supposed to do that. It's, it's indicated, it's useful, it has a purpose. The problem is that most of us now lead lifestyles that we don't have a bit of inflammation now and then. We have chronic inflammation all the time. And that means our blood vessels are often blocked up all the time with fibrin, which means, number one, we can't actually even get red blood cells to a lot of our tissues. So our tissues are starving a bit. But it also means we can't get those adult stem cells there either. So if we're investing, as we should, in releasing the stem cells into our blood, then it's probably a pretty good idea to invest in ourselves enough to say, well, let's make sure the blood can get there. So this is a product called Plasma Flow. It's an enzyme-based preparation. What does it do? It dissolves fibrin. Fantastic. So two of those once a day. Um, it, it says taken best with food, I believe, or something on the label. I found it makes no difference. I found it very effective whenever you take them. I take them in the morning um, once a day, two of those. So that's Plasma Flow. Then, since we all live highly inflammatory lifestyles, well, most of us do, why not take an anti-inflammatory as well? Well, I'll tell you why not, because most anti-inflammatories of a pharmaceutical nature are very, very hard on your body. They're very toxic. They have side effects. They're not good long term. Shouldn't do it. Um, here's one that has none of those problems. Look at that. It's called Cyactive. This is powdered Smurfs, Ian. That's what that is powdered smurfs no it's not really it's a blue um pigment that is extracted from another another blue green cyanobacter it's related to, to afa happens to be spirulina actually which you've probably all heard of it's not whole spirulina though it's a specific extract it's the blue green pigment uh, it turns out that it is anti-inflammatory um on two different inflammatory pathways 
Uh, for those that are interested, it's the Cox 2 and the LOX 5 pathways. So that will blockade further inflammation. So as a, as a holy trinity, I guess, you would say release the stem cells, anti-inflammatories to stop fibrin from developing too much. And if there is any fibrin, get rid of it. Wellness pack, packet of three, cheapest way to do it. Do that on auto ship, obviously, because you get a, def a decent discount by doing it on auto ship. Um, and if you want it even cheaper than that, get three preferred customers, put them on a wellness pack and yours is free. Free. Wow. Unbelievable. Yeah. So that's the, that's the three main um, oral supplement products. There is a fourth product there. Uh, it's called Psyactive Joint, unless you're in the UK, in which case it's called Psyactive Flex for some reason. Okay, fine. That is based on the normal Psyactive, but also it's got other things in it like eggshell membranes and other various herbal things or herbal things if you're American. Um, it's specifically formulated for joints, connective tissues. So if you've got joint issues, rheumatic issues, that kind of thing, you would substitute that one for the standard Psyactive basically. Those are our oral supplement products. There's also a fantastic range of skincare products, which I would absolutely warmly endorse um, as fantastic as well. So there you go. Well, for Bart, I mean, what incredible, knowledgeable, in-depth information you've just given all of us on the product that has got a different twist. It's just deeper than what we've ever heard before. Totally marvellous. You really are brilliant.